All right, now raise your hand if you had the Bucks beating the Chiefs in the Super Bowl. Do you have the Chiefs or do you have the Bucks? I'm going with the Chiefs. Can't put your hand down. What's good, everybody? And we're back. And today, we're going to be doing the Bucks theme team. I know it's been a while since we've done the theme teams, but we're back now. Now, quickly here, since it's been a while, I just want to ask if you all do enjoy this series. We're planning on going through all 32 NFL teams. If you all can hit that like button for me, it would really, really help me out. We're going to put a like over 1,000. If we get there, awesome. If we don't, that's perfectly okay, too. And I also want to hear which team you're most looking forward to throughout the series. Again, we're going to be going through all 32. So whichever team you're looking forward to the most, it can be a team you're a fan of. It can be the theme team that you like to use in Madden, whatever the case may be. I'd love to hear from you. Now, quickly, I want to update you on the rankings here. It's been a while since we've done them. So we did put the 49ers at number two. They played well. They played well, but I did not think they were quite as good as the Raiders. The Raiders is the same team that I use. Now, for my main team, I actually add some players on that didn't play for the Raiders. We, we just want to get to 50 out of 50 for the main team. But for the series, if you didn't play for the team, if you weren't on the roster, we are going to be using you in the video. Then we're going to continue to update the rankings as we go through all 32 so i just wanted to update you on everything get back going in this series because it's been a little while now let's jump over the lineup so i'm actually really excited about this bucks lineup because i feel like they have everything that you want in a theme team we have tom brady's our qb really solid running backs wide receivers are great we have mike evans and chris godwin who both get to 99 speed and then we have keenan mccardell who gets up to 98 speed and has wide receiver playmaker which is probably my favorite ability in the game right now outside of gunslinger it's really really important especially on current gen i feel like in order to beat that man coverage and speaking of current gen i did want to mention that we should have a poll live on our community posts for our channel as this video goes live i did want to hear your all's opinion if you'd like to see more current gen going forward if you like or if you like the format where we go current gen and next gen so i'd love to hear what your all's thoughts are on that so you can check out the community post and put your vote in if you'd like to. Now back to the lineup here. We have Rob Gronkowski as our tight end, who only gets up to 91 speed, but does get routes and issues, so that'll definitely help us out, especially going against man coverage on current gen. And then the O-line's definitely solid. Now, if you see anyone that's out of position, it's likely because they have a secondary position that we can use. So just keep that in mind as you see the lineup as we go through. Now, for our abilities, which I actually forgot to activate until now, we have Tom Brady with Gunslinger and High Route Master and Omaha as the X-Factor. Mike Evans with Just Double Me. Keenan McCardell with Double Me and Playmaker, and then Rob Gronkowski with Route Technician. That's all the offensive abilities. Now jumping over here to the defense, super solid. Again, on both sides of the ball, they have really solid players across the board. And we'll just scroll through them here. And we're going to be using John Lynch and Antoine Winfield Jr. as outside linebackers in the nickel 335 wide. And then Jordan Whitehead is actually going to be our user. With the corners, they're actually going to play a couple of them at safety here. We're just going to scroll through, and uh, I'll zoom in here so that you all can see all the corners but they have some really good corners in addition to mike evans on the outside here we also have jamel dean who's uh in the specialist so i'll show you that as well but definitely some really solid players jumping into the defensive abilities now we pretty much just use mid zone ko and acrobat for our abilities now these are for current gen they may change a little bit when we get to next gen both on offense and defense but they should stay relatively the same maybe change route tech to something else since we might not go against a lot of man coverage on next gen but for the most part they should stay the same if you got mid zone ko for one we pretty much put that on and then murphy bunting we did put on chuck out because we had one extra ap and i figured i'd try it because murphy bunting is going to be in the slot but then across the board if you got acrobat for one with which all corners do we put that on if you got mid zone ko for one we put that on so that's pretty much where our abilities went outside of that one chuck out and then i already did mention that we have jamel dean with acrobat as well who we had in the specialist spot so that's really the team. I mean, that's a really solid team across the board. I feel like they're not really missing anything. And then for team strategy, we're still in the Raiders offense. We're still going to be in the 4-6 defense. That's not going to change. Except on next gen, I did want to try out Gun Bunch, so we will be in the Jets offense. Now, that's it for the team. Let's jump into the game. All right, game one with the Super Bowl champion, Buccaneers. Here we go. And we're going to be starting this one on defense here. It's not the Super Bowl, but it should be a fun one. I hope it's a fun one, right? We'll just have to wait and see. Bounce him back. Send our, send our flat. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Laser, no! That's a laser, no! We, sh we should have, we should have probably, I, I actually don't know what we probably should have done. We shouldn't have clicked off our user, that's for sure. Good dot. We're going to try to shoot the gap on these run plays. We've been getting ran on a little bit, and they go to the PA. That's a nice mix-up, because we were playing the run right there. Send our flat, send our flat. Levante, Levante, I couldn't get there. I couldn't get there. That is on me. Hoping we can shoot the gap this time on any run plays. We did not because it's a PA play again. It's a PA play. Ooh. I thought that was a touchdown for sure. 
Oh, that is a super dot. That is a super laser. We got to try to answer back. We're looking to get Gronk involved early here. Gronk had a great Super Bowl. We don't have it. We don't have it. Gronk had a great Super Bowl. So we'll see if, we, if Gronk can have another great game here. Looking for the same thing here. We're looking for this corner out outside. Not gonna have it, we have Fournette. No, it's not Fournette, it's work done. Come on, Kent, know which players you have in the game. Come on now, come on, come on, come on. My natural instincts just kind of revert back to the current player, probably because we see those players all year long, right? But we have a running back, we have a running back, nice catch. We have a big fourth down coming up. Look at Slander Post right here, we're looking Slander Post. We have Slant, we have Slant. Let's go, Keenan, let's go. Looking for Gronk outside. We're looking for Gronk outside. We don't have Gronk outside, but we have Keenan. We have Keenan. We might have Godwin in the scene here. We might have Godwin in the scene. We do not, we do not. We have the Slant though. We have the Slant though. Let's go. We're looking for one of our hitches or we're looking for work done. We have neither of them. We have neither. We're looking for our seam route again. Don't have it again. But we have the Slant again. We have the Slant, Keenan McCordell. All right, we are down to the three. This is kind of, this is probably gonna be four down territory. We're gonna run it right here. It's gonna be four down territory. Territory. It won't be four down territory if we lose a few here, but we're able to get in. Let's go Fournette. All right. We have a tie game. We have a little bit under two minutes here. We have to try to get a stop. I said under two minutes, but more like precisely one minute. We're sending heavy pressure right here. Look in the flat. Let's go. Oh no, that's a dot. That's a dot. They might have a chance at a field goal now. We have to take away these sidelines. We have to take away these sidelines. No, we took away the sidelines, but we gave up a laser and they have timeouts. That's going to be field goal range. We're sending heavy pressure. We're going to try to knock them out of field goal range. We're sending heavy pressure. Let's go. Ooh, that was really close. That was really close. We're doing the same thing. We're sending heavy pressure again. We're going to try to either force a mistake or get a sack to try to knock them out of field goal range. Either one. But we're going to send heavy pressure right here. And we're going to lurk straight to the running back. We're going straight to the running back. All right, they didn't send them out. We didn't get any pressure though. And they got a laser. Keep them in bounds. Keep them in bounds. Ooh, I was, you know, it was a little bit risky there to try to allow them to stay in bounds, to try to take away the rest of the clock because they might have ended up with a touchdown. But we're going to be able to end up holding the three here. Really nice drive by them. They didn't have a lot of time. They threw dots. It's going to be our ball at halftime. So we have to try to answer back, but great drive by them. We're looking for Mike Evans going deep right here. I think we have it. I think we have it. Tom Brady, Tom Brady. What a pass from Tom Brady. Gonna shoot the gap right here on any run plays. Do we get back there? Nice job, Winfield. I actually just realized right now, I think they might have a Steelers theme team. It's always cool in the theme team series when we go up against another theme team. I'm pretty sure, it, I'm pretty sure it's a Steelers theme team, but speaking of theme teams, if you all wanna see the rest of the theme teams, you can check out the top right-hand corner. It's gonna be one of these, not sure which one, but it'll have a card for the playlist for all of the theme teams that we've done so far. And as we update them, it'll continue to have the rest of them. So if, you, if you're catching this one late, It'll have the ones that are past it as well. We have a big fourth down coming up. Looking to shoot the gap right here. We didn't do it. It's PA again. Laser, absolute laser. We've been struggling against this strong type for the majority of the game. They've been running the ball well on us and then they've been dotting us on the big downs. But we have a chance at a Revis. Revis, Revis makes the play. Let's go. This is a big drive now. We have a chance if we get a touchdown to go up by two possessions. So this is a really big possession. We do not want to make any mistakes right here playmaker up oh oh we were gonna have it we were gonna have it nice defense they've been getting a lot of blocks they've been doing a good job of sending four playing good enough coverage in order to allow their defensive line to make big time plays that's a nice job definitely don't want to make any mistakes right here we're going half back oh i was gonna say we're gonna have to take off with tom we have a big third down right here we don't want to give the ball right back after getting a stop that's something we don't want to do we might have the seam right here we might have the seam we don't we don't Oh no, oh no, we didn't, okay, well, we're probably gonna give the ball right back here, right? Fourth and 14 at our own seven yard line. I feel like that's just something we kind of have to punt the ball away. But we weren't able to get our two possession lead like we were hoping for, we're sending some pressure. It was a screen, screens, they get me almost every time. They get me almost every time, nice play. We weren't able to get our two possession lead, so we're gonna need another stop right here. And there's some pressure again. I was trying to get out to the running back. I couldn't get there, I couldn't get there. We're getting nodded. Open, we can shoot the gap right here. We can, we can, good tackle. We have our spy here for Michael Vick. We're playing a lot of coverage. We're not sending any pressure. We're only gonna send two people right here. This is the biggest play of the game. We have to try to get a stop. Watching the slant. Uh oh, they're gonna have a bounce back route open. Can we swat it out of there? Let's go, great knockout, Rondé Barber. All right, we got another stop. Now we have to either try to clock this one out 
or try to get a touchdown to go up two possessions. Either one, either one's great right here. Maybe break a run with Fournette right here. Maybe break a run with Fournette right here. Ooh, we'll take it. We'll definitely take it. Looking for Gronk outside now. Not there, not there, not there. We have done again. Great job, Tom Brady. Great job. We're going to take this to the two-minute warning. Looking to run the ball again. We'll just take whatever we can get. We didn't get much. Just going to run the ball here again on second down, and we'll, we'll pass the ball on third down. Yeah, I was going to say, depending on how many yards we get. All right, we didn't get much. So we're going to pass the ball again here. On, we're we're going to pass the ball on third and seven. We're going to go slant or post. That's pretty much what we go to on these third and medium amount of yards to go. And I just don't want to make any mistakes. I do not want to throw a pick. We'll take what's ever there for us. We have, we have work. We have work. And then we roll forward for the first down. Let's go. We're going to audible down to the stretch alert bubble here. That way, we can either take a decent amount of time with the stretch since it's an outside run or if we get the first down then we can clock this one out either way and Fournette is that a first down it is a first down let's go Fournette and that is actually gonna do it great game to our opponent we're on to game two all right here we go with game two this one's gonna be on next gen and remember our community post will have a poll just trying to hear you all's opinion on whether you see mostly current gen or if you like the current gen and next gen format that we're using here we go. We actually ended up not changing our abilities at all for this one. So we're gonna be having the same abilities. We're getting down in first play. We're playing a slot offset. If you all have watched my videos before, if you've watched me on stream, I actually struggle with a slot offset. And speaking of the stream, if you all are interested in following me on stream, I have my Twitch linked in the description below. I I'm, I've been trying to stream a little bit more, three to four times a week. Haven't really been meeting my goals, but I've been doing my best and that's all I can do, right? So I hope to see some, some of you all in there. But yeah, we didn't change any of our abilities. We're going with the same ones. We'll see what we can do with it. Again, a slot offset tends to give me some trouble. So I'll try my best on defense here not to get dotted every single play. They might have a dot. They might have a dot. Whitehead. Yeah, they have one. They have one. Nice play. We're going to have to figure out how to stop these runs. We're going to have to figure out how to stop these runs because Derrick Henry, Derrick Henry is doing awesome. We're going to shoot the gap this way now. Looking to shoot the gap this way. That was a little bit better. That was a little bit better. We didn't get our adjustments in. We didn't get our adjustments in. Send our flat. Send our flat. Laser. Absolute laser. I said at the beginning of this game that Ace Lock gives us trouble. I don't think they threw an incompletion. They ran all over us. Great drive. We're going to be trying to use this bunch on this first drive here. We'll see how we can do. Not a great start start sack first play but we'll, we'll see what we can do with that i mean it's my first time using bunch on next gen i haven't used bunch much at all on current gen either so it's definitely gonna be something to get used to it like they had some type of ability on defense to pass rush right there right yeah double or nothing okay we're gonna probably double team outside because we got block shed it really really well on that first play i think we have our out route i think we have our out route godwin godwin nice pass tom let's go we might have our corner right on the outside right here we don't we do actually we don't actually we do actually let's go not our best read first play but we'll definitely take the incompletion i think we have work done let's go work let's go baby let's go let's go work great job we might have godwin in the seam right here we're not we're not gonna have it we're not gonna have it we're not gonna have it. we're not gonna have it i'm looking for the seam again i feel like we could have it this time oh we do we do godwin godwin yes let's go and our flat we are absolutely getting dotted i'm telling you Ace, i'm probably gonna send some pressure I have to sense of pressure because we're not doing a great job of covering the routes that they have out there. And when you can't cover someone's routes, what you probably should just do is just send pressure before they can get to the open routes. You know what I'm saying? So that's what we're going to try to do here. We're going to try to send some pressure. They ran it. They ran it. They ran it. Oh, Derrick Henry looks really good. Working out to the running back. They got the pass off before we can get our pressure there. We're just, we're honestly just struggling to, to stop whatever it is that they're doing. They're five for five. They've, they've ran all over us. We're going to, we're going to send some pressure again though, because that's the only thing that I can really can think of to stop what they're doing right now. Look in the running back, bounce back, let's go. All right, well, that was open, but we'll take it. If we could hold to a field goal right here, that'd be really big. Derrick Henry though, yes, with a great tackle. All right, assuming that they don't go for it, we're gonna be able to hold to three right here. We have we have about two minutes too, so we'll see if we can get a score. Just kidding, they're gonna go for it right here, so we have to try to get a stop. They have something open, they have the flat, they have the flat, click over there, please. Knock out. Yes! Yes! We're able to get the stop. Let's go. I am a little bit worried about block sheds right here. So we're going to try to get the ball out quick. We didn't get the ball out quick. We got block shedded. Now we're on the two-yard line. I'm hoping we can roll out a little bit left here and not get block shedded. We have playmaker as well. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No! Safety! No! Safety! Okay, well, our stop turned into two points for them and them getting the ball back. So... Probably not the stop that we wanted. We probably should have ran the ball there when we were on the seven just to get a little bit of space. But they, they, they did a good job with their abilities. Those double or nothings are doing great for them. And then they're playing great coverage behind it. So they're getting a lot of sacks. 
that way. We have to try to get another stop. Watching the slant here. Bounce back, bounce back. Ooh, dot again, dot again. Every time we don't send pressure, I feel like they're just getting a lot of time in the backfield right here. We're gonna have to mix up what we're doing. Heavy pressure, we're sending heavy pressure here. Good read, nice read. One tackle to Relg. Ooh, they reached for it, nice job. They're in field goal range right here, so we're gonna try to send a little bit of pressure to try to knock them out of field goal range if possible. We're gonna play hard flats. We got some pressure! But since we played hard flats, they had an open corner out. They threw a dot. They threw a touchdown. That is not how we wanted to end the half. We got the stop that we needed. We end up getting a safety. Then they end up getting a touchdown on top of that. So now we're down two possessions. It is going to be our ball at half, but not the spot we want to be in. We have to score quick either here before half or at a halftime. We'll see if we can pick up a big chunk first play here. Can we have our corner out outside? No, we threw a pick. We threw a pick. This is not what we wanted. Please tackle, please tackle. Oh, it's going to be field goal range anyways. It's going to be, this is, this is probably the, the worst possible ending that we could have to a half. We have a stop with a tie game and instead we turn it into a safety, a touchdown, a pick, and maybe a field goal. Let's try to maybe get a sack here to try to knock them back out of field goal range. Whitehead, no laser, laser. All right, they're going to get a field goal now, assuming that they kick it. And uh, yeah, we're going to be down basically two full possessions going into the second half. We're going to need a quick score and then we're gonna need a quick stop, and then we're gonna need another quick score. We'll see if we can do it. Here we go. We're looking for our playmaker or corner route right here. Playmaker. Oh, we had it. We had it. Oh no. We, we're we just, we're not getting the block. They have four sacks with Chase Young. We're just not, we're not getting enough time to throw the routes that we're looking for. So we need to get the ball out quicker. That's on us. I can't, I can't blame my O-line when we're not getting the ball out quick, right? So that's kind of what we have to do. We do have our playmaker. That's what we're looking for right now. We have it. There we go. There we go. Let's go. All right. We got to get it. We got to get it moving. We got to get it moving. Got work. We got work. Let's go, Dunn. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. We'll, ta we'll take it. We got to keep it going. I think we might have our out route outside right here. We're looking for it. I think we have it. Godwin. Godwin. Let's go. Hoping we can get in the end zone right here as quick as we can. Another block shot. I'm telling you. I am telling you. LeVar Arrington and Chase Young have been doing amazing. Hoping we get enough time right here. We're looking for Evans. I think we have Evans. We do. Yes. Let's go. All right. We got the score that we needed. Now we kind of need to stop. Let's see if we can get it here. We haven't done great. We haven't done great. We're going to send our flat. Oh, laser again, laser again. I am really not sure how to stop this offense. I've been trying to figure out how to stop it for basically the last three or four years of Madden. Open these adjustments, stop it now. They didn't, they didn't, laser. Now, if they do get a field goal, we're still within one possession. We have to get the two point conversion, but at least we're not out of the game because they've driven down the field super fast. They have driven down the field super fast. They're probably gonna run right here. I kind of want to run commit, but I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I kind of want to. I'm not gonna do it. We probably should have. We probably should have. Great tackle, Warren Sap. Oh, they ran it. They ran it. They ran it. Is that a first? Is that a first? It's not a first down. This is the biggest play of the game right here. We're run committing. I don't know if we can stop the run or not, but we are run committing right here. Did we get through? We got through. We got through. We got through. Let's go. We need one score. We're going to start this drive by running the ball because last time we were down here, we got a safety. We're going to run it again here. I would like to get a first down on the ground if we can. If we can get another four yards, I'll run it again. If we don't get anything, we're probably going to have to pass, but I would definitely like to get it running the ball let's see what we can do with work done here we got some space we got some space let's go all right now we don't have to worry as much about a safety we're looking for our out route outside here i think we might have godwin they did a great job user and they did a great job user and we got nothing open gotta get the ball out quick here taking our hitch we're taking our hitch let's go keenan if they don't use her we should have our out route outside we don't, we don't. We have to take Gronk. We have to take Gronk. That made it a little bit more manageable. We have a big fourth down coming up right here. We took a timeout. I didn't want to have to do it, but I felt like we needed to get our best play out there. And I didn't like the play call that we had. I feel like this is the biggest play of the game. It's the biggest play of the game right here. If we don't get it, we can. We could have still used those timeouts, but at the same time here, I feel like we kind of need to pick this up. So we're looking for our running back wheel. I think we have it. Yes, we have it. Let's go. We absolutely needed that first down right there. So I'm really glad that we picked it up. We're going back to Warren here. That running back wheel seems to be there. That running back wheel seems to be there. We're going to get on the ball and we're going to run the same thing. I'm really liking that running back wheel. Until they man it up, I'm probably going to keep on throwing it. So we'll see if it's still there. They man it up this time. Really nice adjustment. But we have our post. We have Keenan McCardell. We have Keenan. Oh, that's on my run stick. That is on my run stick right there. We probably 
could have got some more yards, maybe even a touchdown right there, but we're going to keep this one moving. I'm really liking that play. I am really liking that play. We'll see if they man up the running back again, but we're getting a little bit low on time. We still have two timeouts. But we're getting a little bit low on time. We have Evans outside and we got out of bounds. I'm really liking mesh post right here. We're going to stick with it. Do we have that? Work done. Work done. Work done. We are down to the two yard line these are the biggest plays of the game right here we're gonna call inside zone we uh you know what we, we have we have timeouts we can go back to inside zone later maybe this play we shouldn't do that we're not gonna call inside zone yet we have plays we can go back to if we need to right so we're just gonna stick we're gonna stick with the pass right here we have our timeouts we don't want to take a sack though we do not want to take a sack throw it away throw it away throw it away i'm hoping we can throw one of our hitches right here we're looking for one of them we have that on on b no, I don't know if we did or not. I don't want to force a mistake. I don't want to force a mistake. We have other downs. We have 25 seconds. We do have a timeout. I kind of want to try running the ball right here. Like we have a run play that we can go to because we have the timeout. So that's in that's in our play call options right here. But I'm just, I'm so nervous that we're not going to get this touchdown. We're going to try the run here. They have inside stuff and that definitely stopped it. So you know what? Last play, well, biggest play of the game right here. We're basically going with the spacing concept. I think we'll have one of our hitches. I think we have Y. Godwin! Godwin, yes! All right, we got it! This is a big two-point conversion, though, because they showed already that they can get into field goal range quickly. So this is a big two-point conversion to give us a three-point uh, three lead. But we have the lead anyways, assuming we don't throw a pick. Or I guess, I'm, I want to say pick six, but it'd only be a, a pick two, I guess you could say. But we need a touchdown. We need a, we need a score right here. Oh, 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 Mike Evans. Okay, we're not going to get in. We have 20 seconds here to try to stop them. 20 seconds. I am so, so nervous. We have our purple set to 30. We have our flat set to 15. I'm hoping none of those will get open over top of them. They did. That's a super laser. They might already be in field goal range. They might already be in field goal range that is not how we wanted this drive to go i'm trying to think here we have to figure out a way to get some pressure we're sending pressure and we're lurking right we're sending pressure and we're lurking right laser no 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 game over we're gonna lose we are gonna lose it right there that is not what we wanted we're gonna lose it oh that was i told you that 20 seconds was too much they scored in two plays we did our best we did our best in this one honestly the biggest the biggest part of this was honestly it coming down to the to the field goal and the safety before halftime those were the biggest plays of the game now i know we ended up losing by seven and that's only five points but it was a huge swing we honestly probably could have Oh, we, we're going to lose it. Uh, we, we tried to pitch it back there. Oh! Oh, can we go? Oh, Fournette! Fournette! This is the greatest ending in Madden history! I can't believe it! I can't believe it! I can't believe it! There's no way that just happened! There is no way that that just happened! I can't believe it. Please make this field goal. Please make this field goal. I can't believe that just happened. I cannot believe that that just happened, but we're going to overtime. We're changing up our defense a little bit. I feel like we haven't really been getting any stops. So we're gonna change up what we're doing to try to try something else, right? Cause it's not like we've been doing a great job anyways. Ooh, I tried to break down on that. Nice read, nice read. We're getting dotted, we're getting dotted. I haven't been able to stop this formation all game. Not again, not again. They're back inside. They're down inside the red zone. This is the only way we've gotten stops all game, right? It's inside the red zone. We'll see if we can do it one more time. The change didn't work for us, right? The change did not work for us to the other defense. We're going back to the 3-3-5 wide. We, we have a second and goal here. I'm going to actually run commit. I am going to run commit. If they pass the ball, then probably GG's. But if they don't pass the ball, then we should stop it. They threw the bubble screen and we're going to lose. Oh, we lost. They went down. Well, we can try to run commit again. Run commit, run commit, run commit, run commit. Run commit. Look, the bubble screen. Oh, and they're in. We lost it. All right. Great game to them. I mean, they deserved it in regulation, right? It, they deserved it in regulation. I can't believe that ending of that game. We just, we couldn't get a stop. We couldn't get a stop. So great game to them. Full on. They deserve that win. We, the only stops we got were in the red zone when they went for it on fourth down and short, right? So 
Great game to them. I hope you all enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to fill out the, well, don't fill out, you vote on the poll for our community post to see if you guys just want to see current gen or if you'd like to see some current gen and some next gen. Either way, it's completely up to you guys for the, for the videos going forward for the most part. So that's it for the video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please remember to like, comment, subscribe. Only if you want to. I love you all. Take it easy. Peace. Wow, what an ending in that last game. I wish we would have got the win. We didn't in this one. I'll see you all in the next one.